So the biggest reason we wanted the truck bed cover is because we have a truck tent that you guys will see in some vlogs, but I'll insert a picture or five right here. And the sleeping situation is memory foam, comforter. Fur furry blanket, comforter thingy, two sleeping bags, no blow up mattress or anything like that. So we didn't want to have to stuff all that stuff in the truck when we're going on our trip. So we got a bed cover to just close up the tent, put it in there. And then just in case to be double waterproof, we're going to tuck the tent over everything and then put like our lawn chairs on top. Just wanted to clarify a couple things while I'm editing this. So we had a tropical storm roll through the other night and discovered that the corners do leak a little bit. Nothing too concerning, but I think that the high wind and the downpours just worked together to make crazy conditions to where that would actually happen. But anyways, so to make sure that our bedding setup that we have in there is triple waterproof, we're going to also have a tarp. So the tarp's gonna go under the tent and the sleeping setup, and then the tent's gonna be on top. So we'll fold the tent closed, and then we'll fold the tarp over that, and then we'll take our camp chairs, wedge them in between the wall of the bed of the truck and the tent setup so that everything stays nice and secure while we're driving so nothing moves around in case there is some kind of rainstorm or whatever. So we'll have the three layers of water protection, the gator cover, the tarp, and the tent. So it'll be hopefully secure and waterproof. <laughs> I'll actually have a video soon for you guys to see our actual tent set up because I think that's the next thing on my to-do list for videos. And then we're going to roll this over so that if it storms, we have double protection for our sleeping stuff. Come from your side over to this way. There you go. Realistically, he could have done it by himself, but I wanted to feel special. It goes up in that little, yep, uh-huh. Uh-huh, <laughs> that little what? Oh, like that. Okay. Yeah. And this is a gator truck bed cover. So, if you're yeah. curious, there are lots of gaskets and seals around it to make it waterproof. And, of course, this Velcro is tilted against whatever rain would come in. So it's like a really strong Velcro situation. Not your average Velcro. And then the back is sealed. The only place I'm worried about water getting in potentially is right here where this foam is. Cause I mean the foam's not waterproof. So if we wanted to, we could just tape some kind of water protection thing up in there with some Gorilla Tape. We bought some all-weather Gorilla Tape for this setup anyways. But yeah, overall I think it's gonna work great. You happy with yourself? I'm happy with myself. <laughs> so the only way to get in is you have to open the tailgate, which Okay. Okay. Sometimes my truck's tailgate doesn't like to come down. So like the that. tailgate closes up against that seal. Real nice. There we go. So you just push this? Pull. Pull? Yeah. There you go. All right. And that's it. You have to close it. You just make sure that it's 
cook it under that. Click. Like so. That storm was completely avoiding us, but I kind of hope that it hits now so we can see if it works. 